Hello from Aswan. We checked in our hotel, resort, I would say. It's called a resort. Yeah, <laughs> and I wouldn't really call it like that because it looks like something from 1960. It's like really a rundown hotel. Anyways, not the point. So we are going to go for a dip and then watch the sunset and then probably get some room service hamburgers Yeah. because we are exhausted. Today was such a long day. Uh, if you watched my last video, I just ended it sitting in this exact same spot talking about how exhausting today was. <laughs> uh, so we finally got to Aswan and yeah, tomorrow is going to be even more exhausting because we are waking up at 4 a.m. 4 a.m. Yeah. 4 a.m. to go to Abu Simbel, which is about three hour drive south of Aswan as well as um, our driver told me how to say it, Philae Temple, something Maybe. like that. It's on the island. But anyways, we will see you when we're there. Pretty exhausted after our day at Abu Simbel and Philae. Philae? I, I still don't know how to say it. Anyways, it was super, super windy, so I didn't bother filming anything other than just what we were seeing because A, like I said, very windy. You probably couldn't have heard me. And B, there was like a million people there. So it was pretty loud. I think Abu Simbel would have been my favorite temple so far if there wasn't so many people. It is easily by far the busiest place we have been. Like probably two or three times the amount of people we've seen in any other temple, which really sucks because it was like super, super cool. But there were so many people that when you went inside, it was like, a million degrees and you couldn't breathe so we didn't stay very long unfortunately which sucks because we drove so far to get there and it was totally worth it it just sucked that it was so hot and full of people and huge like just there's no air it was really weird but anyways we are going out for dinner now Resorts free breakfast, which I would say is okay at best. It's not like terrible, it's okay. Although the view is pretty cool. I just ate some, <laughs> it tasted like children's food. <laughs> so, I believe we have made up our mind on what we're gonna do today. I think we're gonna start out by taking a ferry to the West Bank and go to I can't even remember which one we're going to first. I should probably look into that either Tombs of the Nobles or St. Simeon's Monastery. Whichever one is the furthest one away from where we are, is where we're going first. I wanna say it's Tombs of the Nobles we're going to first. And then after that, I think we are going to take a ferry over to Elephantine Island and either just eat there or depending on the time, we are going to explore. There's a few Nubian villages and a pyramid. I don't think it's a very big pyramid, but there is a pyramid over there. So, that are, that's our plans for today or at least our potential plans for the day, depending on how long the first two stops take us. And then we also still have one other day, so we might do Elephantine Island tomorrow. We shall see. Anyways, we are about to head out, so let's go.
Joseph is our cameraman because my camera, I don't know what's wrong with it. It's not turning on or charging. Like not enough power, I would say. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's going on, but it's not working. And also, my phone is like completely out of storage space because we fell asleep before moving stuff off of it last night. So we're using Joseph's phone to film today. And Kelly hates it. Yeah, I hate it. But also, Joseph's my cameraman, so we'll see how he does. Today we went to the Tombs of the Nobles, and then we took a camel ride to St. Simeon's Monastery. Yeah, some, some, yeah. And I would say you didn't mind the camel ride. Did you I, enjoy the camel ride? I didn't mind it. I enjoyed it, I think, but my bag mm -hmm. got hurt by a saddle a little bit, and I like it was good but I wouldn't do it again I would say I was pretty terrified the entire time I yeah. was very very nervous I don't really like riding horses so I don't <laughs> know why I was so excited to ride a camel yeah. but we did we rode a camel and yeah. then anyways we're gonna grab lunch at a Nubian restaurant right now and then I think we're either going to Elephantine Island or a botanical garden mm -hmm. on an island yeah. I'm not sure so we will see then I'm about to eat a uh, chicken pashin. On a whim this morning, hired a private Fluka for the day. Our driver was just like, I don't know, a nice dude. Yeah. So we just said, sure, we'll take a Fluka all day. So, anyways, we ended up taking it to uh, the Botanical Garden rather than Elephantine Island. And I think we're only going to have time for this in the sunset. So, yeah. Elephantine Island will be tomorrow, I believe, which is our last day here. Mm -hmm. So, we are now in a Botanical Garden. So, allow us to show you. This is really weird that I'm building this. Will you marry me? Yes. <laughs> is it on my fat finger? <laughs> so, I'm opening a bottle of sparkling fruit juice, which could appear like a champagne, but it's not a steak. I don't know to sell it over here, almost like anywhere. And it's so funny because it also looks like a champagne. Sounds like champagne. Yes, definitely. <laughs> so we actually are having some vodka in our sparkling fruit juice because we did find a guy last night who had vodka. Good morning from Elephantine Island. I know yesterday we said many times that we were going to come here, but we didn't. We did not make it here. So today, that is our plan. We just got dropped off on the like further away side of the island. I don't know how to explain because I don't know what direction anything is at this point. But far away from like the fancy hotels here. And... Right now, I think the whole island is Nubian villages, but I'm actually not sure. But we are ex walking around looking for either a cafe or food, and we seem to have found some um, goats. So we're just walking along the street, and there was just a bunch of sheep in the street. So we walked like a couple steps further and came across this gigantic, I think it's called Movenpick, I think that's how you pronounce it, um, the gigantic hotel. And it's just like a village with a wall and then the beautiful hotel on the other side. It's kind of weird to see.
wandering around. I think Joseph got us lost, if I'm honest. But everywhere we go on this village, there's just like little, I don't know if you can even see, they're pretty much in the shade back there. But there are goats everywhere. So we are on a small island. It's Elephantine Island, I think. Yeah. And there is uh, not much stuff remain till now. All of it seems like we're really damaged and it's just like scrapes and most of the temples are like rebuilt and they use like small pieces of the remains so it's like i wouldn't say that it's not interesting but i would say it's like mm, it's not bad about Aswan that is different than other places uh, well at least Luxor is I think that the like people trying to show you stuff here to yeah. get tips is a lot more aggressive like in in Luxor when we said we weren't interested in seeing something or in any of the big temples we went yeah. to um, they would we'd be like no thank you no thank you they and they, they would leave us alone and they'd go yeah. try to get tips from someone else and show somebody else something interesting but here in Aswan like you don't have a choice you say no yeah. thank you and you say we're fine no and, and like they won't leave you they follow you and it's like it's really frustrating yeah. and it's like not even just that we don't want to tip them or anything like that it's we're not interested in having someone show us around and rush us all around yeah, yeah. a temple like uh, yesterday when we went to Tombs of the Nobles, we barely had any pictures or any footage of it because the guy yeah. that was showing us around was like getting annoyed with us. Yeah. And it's just like, man, we didn't ask you to show us. Can you yeah. stop rushing us around this place? Yeah. It's like, I don't know, I don't mind when they show us stuff, but I don't want to like run with them and they showing us like everything really quickly and like here 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 i just want like look and take a pictures and be fine and, and it's so. nice to just like explore it on our own sometimes yeah, for sure. especially like where we are right now it's not like there's not that much history that they can even really tell us yeah the guy was just pointing at us in he the right direction was pointing at a, like where we are supposed to go and at the and reading the, the, and the reading signs the to signs us <laughs> which were next to the temple so it was like i don't really need this. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications to see our new videos. If you have any questions, let us know in the comments below. Please share this video and give us a like. To see more from us, check out our Instagram, at Joseph and Kaylee, or catch up on some of our older videos.